Would you like to have a database management solution that can manage multiple database engines, provision, patch, and protect them? Hi, my name is David Teague, Technical Marketing Engineer at Nutanix. And in this video series, we're going to talk about Nutanix Era and what sets it apart from other database management solutions. Welcome to part three of our Era series, Patching. Era can currently manage patching for Microsoft SQL Server, PostgreSQL, and Oracle. The patch process utilizes ERA's software profiles. Because you use the same software profiles for provisioning when you do a new deployment, your new database server will be the same version and patch level as the rest of your environment, keeping your new deployments consistent with your existing environment. This will speed up your new database deployments compared to installing the database software manually, as you do not need to install any patches to match your current standard. The process for patching is similar for all the supported databases. There are some slight differences in the creation of a new patch software profile for Microsoft SQL Server. To update PostgreSQL and Oracle, you would choose an existing database server or deploy a new one with the software profile you want to update. You would then apply the patches to that database server. You would then use the server you patched as a source to update the software profile. Once that new version of the software profile is published, any database server provisioned with that profile will show that it has an update available. With Microsoft SQL Server, the process is a little more streamlined. You would choose the software profile you want to apply the update to, choose Create, then provide the cumulative update file or patch file. It will upload that to the ERA server and apply it to the software profile. When that is complete, you can publish it so that the database servers will show that they have an update available. Once the software profile updates are published, the patch process in ERA is the same across the supported database engines. The older versions of the software profile will still be available to be used for deployments until they are decommissioned. This allows you to deploy an older version of your database engine in case you need to test and see if the patch is responsible for an unexpected change or problem in your environment. If you decommission an older version of a software profile that has servers that were deployed with that profile, those servers will show their patch status as update required. This is useful if you have a software profile version that has a security vulnerability and you need to let your database admins know that they need to patch it ASAP, which can be critical for security. ERA gives you complete control over the patches you are using. You are not relying on updates being provided from a database as a service cloud solution or third party tools to manage your database patching. You can choose what patches you want to apply in your environment. Now that we have created our new software profile version, let's step through the patching process. We will start with this Oracle server. This server is showing its status as update required as the software profile it was deployed with has been decommissioned as shown here. We will choose to update and decide whether to patch now or later. This allows you to choose a date you want the patch to run so you can choose a planned outage window or known low usage time. The patching process also has an API equivalent button if you would like to do this with an automation tool. With this Microsoft SQL Server AG group, the process is the same. You have the same options. The biggest difference will be that the database will be kept online during the patch process. You can follow the patching process on the database server VM details page or the operations page. If your database server is a Postgres SQL cluster, Oracle Rack, or Microsoft SQL Server availability group, your database will remain online and available during the patching process. ERA allows you to control the whole process. You can choose what patch files you want to use and when to update your database servers and not be beholden to outside patching source to control the patching process. So that's how ERA manages patching. ERA's patching process will be more efficient than if you were doing it manually because ERA attaches the patch files to the local VM from a snapshot on the local Nutanix cluster. This will save you time because it does not need to copy files from another source before it can begin the patching process. This is part three of our video series. Look for part four soon. Thank you for watching.